Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Terraria. In this episode, I'm hoping to finish up this house, and honestly, I don't really know. <laughs> I don't really know what I'm gonna do. There's so much in this game that I just don't really know what to do. Um. Probably gonna work on the house during the night. As you can see, it's getting there. I also wanna clear s just one thing up. In the previous ep in the previous episode, I said that five fallen stars makes a mana star. That is wrong. It makes a mana crystal. I was thinking of the stars that restore your mana. Which we will get into those a little later. I think I'm just gonna try to chop down some more wood for building the house, and then when night hits, I'm going to work on the house, cut it. I will cut it so you don't have to watch it. We can get into more interesting things I might I'll probably go uh, exploring check out what's around and uh, other than that I don't think I'm gonna, I'm gonna be doing much and trust me trust me here this game will get a lot more interesting a little later on. But at the moment, more, at least to me. But right now, it's a little slow with the having to make, yeah, having to make a house and such. And such. <sighs> this has pretty much been the uh, close to half an hour of work. Also, getting him out of the goddamn hole over here that he fell into. Ass hat. <sighs> Kyle. <laughs> There's gonna be a lot more NPCs. Like, there's gonna be like, there's, there's gonna be a lot more layers onto this. Like, imagine it, like, well, eleven more on top of this. It's a big house. And then normally add another layer on top of that, with like other things. That'll get into later. I have a lot of explaining to do in this game. I really do. Because there's so much. In the... I know in the next update that's coming out in June. Oh, and here's night. I probably should have gotten in here already. But whatever. In the next update, there's going to be over 3,000 items. That's a lot. That's a lot of items. That's, that's some FTB level. That's some FTB level stuff right there. If you ever, if you've ever played FTB, it's like, it's heavily modded Minecraft say the least but I will be working on this and I'll cut right now I will see you when it's not night and welcome back we I just it literally just turned day like 
five, six seconds ago. The zombies are running away, scared. Better be. <laughs> Sorry if I'm not energetic enough for you. As I normally am, actually. Just, uh, I'm, I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. And that looks like it's, yeah, that's a house now. I, I'm gonna show this off right here. Wooden hammer. It, uh, it, uh, breaks walls. Oh, and it does this. This is pretty cool. This is awesome. Um, for the moment being, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do that. So little Kyle, the douchebag, doesn't get out of the house. And now they're gone. Yay. I'm so happy. Suck one. <laughs> um. Do that. Yeah. Just gonna dig out the stone here. Plug it up so that slime doesn't get in. And I, I guess I could start explaining how you can, uh, well, some more things here. Um, the little button I clicked here, it shows if the uh, NPC considers it their house and where they are living. For it to, there's a, there require, I forget exactly the requirements for a house, but I know it needs to be a decent size. This is, this is a pretty big house. Like if you put a wall like right here, that, that could be a house for him. It needs to have walling. Wood walls. I made them. You make that. The workbench. One wood equals four wood walls. And you, well, you also need lighting. That's a, another important thing. I think it also needs doors. to be considered a house and it also must have a table and a chair the doors the tables and the chairs all made at a workbench right here what I'm gonna be trying to do is make a furnace which will allow us to start to get a start to smelting and making other things, other goodies. See which? I know there's one button that uh, brings up the torch. I'll have to check that. Or any sort of light that you have. I just need to make a lot more torches. How many? Oh yeah, I have, I have a lot. That works. That's that's plenty. Um, it 
H is, I think. H. I know H is the button for health. He instantly will take that one. When I want to use it. I'll get into making these later, because you can get. There is alchemy in this. Um. Really? All I can do right now is do this. Go mining. Which I will be doing. Hopefully. I don't have that much time left. We only have like two minutes. That's okay. I'm glad I got the house done. That is a big part of all of this is getting a house a base of your operations here in whatever you named your world because it matters what you named your world uh, what didn't weird I don't know why I didn't pull wood blocks there Done. You suck one. Hey, hey. I said suck one. Slimes really aren't hard to deal with. If you have, if you have a wood sword, they're pretty good. Wood armor is also pretty, pretty effective. Bunch of copper. Also, another thing is getting seven. I mean, not seven. Fifty silver coins. Because when you get fifty silver coins, a special thing happens with an N with a NPC. You get an NPC called Merchant. Okay, level three. Show up. Ropes. Ropes are pretty effective. The the old way is of getting out of caves because that's something that if you go into a deep hole, you'll have to get that and. Quickly, I'm going to explain equipables. Well, I, th I think I have explained equipables, but you see, look, look right here at my hands. You can see them. Now you can. I'm gonna show them all. Probably in the next video, cause we are, we are out of time. So. I'm just gonna start running off to the house and well let's cut it off right here I will see you in the next video see ya